What's up, YouTube? It's Easy Daniels here, and we're bringing you Technic episode four. And the last episode, I said we're gonna get started with EE, so I didn't lie. But before we start with that, we're gonna build ourselves something that will help us out throughout the entire game. Now, this item, it's way hundred million times better than making a diamond pickaxe. And yes, I'm trying to drop hints so people can be like, "Oh, I know what he's making." Because we're only going to have to make it once. It's not something that we're going to have to remake a bunch of times. So, the item is, because now i got the two necessities for it, a drill. And it's going to be a diamond drill. It's everything a diamond pickaxe can do. But, ooh, I can do question mark in this. I didn't know that. But it's everything a diamond pickaxe can do, but it'll never run out of durability. There's only one downside. One sec, let me get some diamonds. Dang, here, using our diamonds. One, two, three, we're at 17. But we're going to turn this into 14 diamonds by the end. So, here we go. Let's go over back to our crafting table. Get the drill, put three diamonds around it like that. It's a diamond drill. Now you see right now, look it, that's no use to us. See, just, it's like your hand. Because look it, you can tell the power bar right here. It's not powered, that's not powered, that's powered. So let's go in our bat box. It's almost full, as you can see. Almost 40,000. So we're going to put this at the top, and you see this bar is slowly going to increase, and it's going to drain power from our bat box. And didn't even use all of it. So it's perfect. Let's take this out now. Now let's see it. That is fast. So that's just what we're going to be using. I'm going to get a bucket, too. That's probably a good idea. And we're going to go get some water. Head down to find some lava, then we'll bring it up. Actually, I don't even need to go down and find some lava. There's some over here. Let's just get this, because I don't care about a lava source. Because before the series, I was thinking, should we use our power off solar, or should we just um, use lava and not care about the environment? But I, 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 my good side of me came out, so I had to do that. Let's go over here, though. Get some of this obsidian. And here's a little trick I learned. I never knew this. Direwolf20 taught me this, who teaches me a lot about Technic Pack, even though this does not apply to Technic Pack. It applies to legit Minecraft. So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to go like this. Ooh, there's marble, and that will be helpful to us when we start building the house. And we're going to put that there. And I'm thinking, what is that? Then I'm going to go mining this. Oh, yes, it's way faster on obsidian. You guys probably won't get bored of watching obsidian. See, if there was lava underneath me, it automatically seal up the lava. Which I think it... See? Ooh, I got scared there. But see how it automatically just plows through that lava? I never knew that. So that's a good technique that I'm going to start using all the time now. More lava. Okay, or not. So I'm just going to go off camera. I'm going to get about how much for a portal? 10. So I'm going to get about 15 pieces of a city and I will be back. So see ya. Alright, so I'm back in my house and I'm just... I already made the portal, by the way, so I didn't, like, cheap out. And, oh my gosh, I'll be right back real fast. All right, sorry about that. That was just me being stupidly stupid. So we're putting this back in here. Yes, I already built the portal. We're going to go to it. And I thought we built it in a nice place. Save me from chopping down two obsidian. Well, help me conserve two obsidian. I still cut down 16. But we're going to go over here. And I just kept it right where that fire pit is. And I thought it was a good idea. So that's where it is, far away from us. Don't have to worry about it. Not too far, just far enough. So we're going to go in here. We're going to the nether. We are going to the nether. Let's go to the nether. Okay, I brought stacking blocks. I was scared for a sec. Please get a good nether spawn. Please get a good nether spawn. Building terrain. Dot, 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 dot. Okay, then. Hopefully it doesn't crash. Oh, yes, we're here. Lag city chick, lag city chick. Okay, yep, did better not be underground. Oh, at least there's no lava above us. Why do I always get these crappy nether spawns? Hmm. 
I'm at 119. How higher do I have to go? Found it. Let's go. Okay, so we're right here. This is a, a w temporary walkway. Actually, I don't even know if we're ever going to come back here, so let's just let me know where we're at. This is not on top of the world. No, 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 no. No. This is like actually hard to dig steps. Actually, steps might be easier, but digging it was kind of hard. Let's just keep digging. Actually, let me pause this. I'm really going to find my way around here because I am getting irritated right now. That's the void. Crap, my um, pick's running out of durability. My mining drill. That's the only bad thing about it, but in later episodes, we're going to get something that will fix that. And see, now it's just like a diamond pick. Not like a diamond pick, like a stone, probably. Let me just chop. This is like a diamond pick, has the same tolerancy, I guess you would say. How would I get down there? I have to take a fall. Oh my gosh, I'm hating the nether right now. Ooh, if I would have died, I would have been heated. Look at where the glowstone is. Are you joking? Let's go find some stuff. I'm actually going to pause your corner and go find some stuff because I don't know how I'm going to get there. I'm going to stack over there or something, but I'll be back. So I'm in the nether here. Here's this glowstone I found. I just went up a little bit to the right. And there's this veins about just a little bit of climb. I came from that corner right there. But we have about enough. This is something that I don't need to get a lot here. Because this is the one of the items which I'm going to get with a mod. Like, easy to get to. I'm not going to try to, like, overuse this mod, which is EE, for those of you who know it. But I'm trying not to overuse it. But this is glowstone because I hate coming to the nether that I will happily get it from the mod. But I have enough right now. This is plenty. I'm going to head back home and pick it up in the house and then we'll start building. So, be right back. So I am back at my base, so we're going to be building that out this episode, so I'm just, I'll block it off just in case. Put this mining drill in here, and let's sort this out a little bit. 21, for that, oh, 59, we actually got a lot more than I thought we did. I, I didn't think we made out at all. Like, I thought, I thought we made like five. But, let's get glowstone, we need a diamond for this. Um, what was I looking for? Redstone. Let's go over here to this, this crafting table. Because um, we're only going to make one, so I'm going to go in here. Glowstone. Corners, like this. Redstone in the middle. This will give us a philosopher's stone. And this is really cool. So you see my floor, right? I'm not a fan of having grass floors. So let me hold shift. Oh, let me charge up. Hold up. Yeah, see? Not, uh, we don't need this. So basically, this can turn things to into other things. So like, grass gets turned to sand. If you shift click on grass, it will get turned into cobble. Cobble can be turned into smooth stone. And it can also change mobs, I'm pretty sure, but it has to be charged up pretty good. One sec, let me just go through all this and then I'll just go outside and show you it on a tree. What does a tree? Right One sec. I'll be right back. Right Sorry about that. I'll be right back. Uh, no, I'll be right back. I am back. Ooh, I feel stupid right now. So, we're going through this. And this is really nice. Just made a nice little floor. But I think I might like the grass better. I don't know. This is for demonstrational purposes. Please don't change out here. Nice. Perfect. But... This is, that's what that is. My, oh, I feel so enclosed now. Ew. This is done. Now let's start getting to really what we want to do. I want to make this out of 
Crap, is there a volcano anywhere near here? I know there's a button. There, X. How'd I guess that button? No volcanoes. Alright, then we're gonna make it out of this. Let's go get some of this. Marble, which I said in the volcano that we're gonna be using it. I would much rather make it out of the stuff you get from volcanoes, which we haven't experienced yet. Because our world is kind of leaving us hanging on that. And whenever there's marble, there's a huge vein, so that's how I knew I could just start digging. It's always, like, huge, like, way more than you need. This is plenty right here. Head back to base. And we're going to extend our house, add this in there. This is going to be a back room, which is going to be used for EE. This is going to be an EE room. There might be, like, one other thing in there if I change my mind, but for what right now my plan is going to be an EE room so if we get this marble like this this is going to give us marble bricks let's just get, start building this in oh I wish we had a light color wood but no let's stick that would be kind of tacky we have a dark house let's go over here start extending this so that one like this let's leave two I don't need this. Ooh. Two of this, but yeah, it's plenty big. What if I can close the walls like that, though? Let's just do it. Let's go out in nine blocks. That should be fine. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Yeah, this is plenty big of room. So after I get the base, I'm just going to pause it build it real fast and then we'll get to the interesting stuff because i feel like this recording is getting lengthy for some reason but yeah i'm gonna pause it and get the interesting stuff and we're back the stone is just finishing up and then we can get ready i will show you guys the other room yes i changed the floor back to grass also here's the other room short and sweet i wonder what size it is well, it's, cause i wanted a nine by nine and then i kind of just kind of eyeballed it I wonder how close I was. So this is this recipe, and this is, I will explain this in grave detail. And then all we need is this philosopher's stone, and we put this here. This is going to give us a transmutation tablet, and we don't lose a philosopher's stone, thankfully. Because this is also, no, wrong button, a crafting table. But you didn't know that, did you? And it can do a lot more stuff that I'm just not experienced with. And I didn't even show you guys it hitting the trees. I feel stupid. I'm going to put glass here. If we have When we get extra glass. Yeah, that'd be a nice one. No. I'll put glass around the sides, actually. I lost a piece of wood. And I feel stupid for wasting all that time. Alright, so where's the middle? I make this three. One, two, three. Perfect. This is what I do for everyone. I got this from Dratnos. This was the first transmutation tablet I've ever seen, and I always do that. I don't know why. Don't ask me. But here it is. And basically, let's go get some items. All right, we'll just I'll just explain it here. This may look kind of bizarre, but basically in this mod EE equivalent exchange, everything has a value. So let's put a piece of cobblestone in here. Learn. So you have to learn everything before you can turn it into it. This has one value. But we can always get it back. Or we can burn it in here. And then we just have one value saved up. And then we just pull out one value. So basically, you can pull out what you put in, but you have to have it learned. So let's say you burn up one, two, three cobble. And then we teach our transmutation tablet a marble. Let's burn up another. We can pull out four marble now. See? So basically, it's just trading. And that's what I was talking about, how I'm going to get my glowstone. And is that it? Let me see. Because we're going to be making a storage room. Let me see this. Oh, that's pricey. We'll be doing that later. So that's it for this episode. It was a pretty short and sweet episode. All we did was get this and go to the nether. But I think it was pretty successful and accomplished a lot. Next episode, we're going to be building a quarry, which automatically mines for you. So look forward to that. That is it for this episode. I will see you guys later. Peace.